Hello there Pisces, I am the Soul Teacher, welcome to my channel. I am here today to do your new moon in Pisces reading. So um, in the Scorpio reading, um, I thought to myself, wow, um, actually I told Scorpio that I think for Pisces this is going to be a very, very powerful new moon. So Pisces, um, <clears throat> a new moon is all about starting new things, about um, maybe when you want to start this new life and there's something that you want to take with you to your new life, this is also a perfect time to renew that old energy and get rid of the old so that there's space for the new. Um, also, because this is the new moon in Pisces, as you know, Pisces is the dreamer of the zodiac. So everything and anything that you've ever dreamed of, you can now... With the help of this beautiful new moon in Pisces energy, you can now bring into your reality and manifest that. How awesome is that? So your overall energy for this phase is play. Have fun, celebrate, don't be so serious. Um, and you see that nice, she's sitting in a glass of champagne and you see how brightly the sun is shining, but the lights that's coming down or the, the streaks are blue and purple. How beautiful is that? So what I feel here, Pisces, is um, when you're in this energy of play and this energy of um, happiness and joyfulness and celebration, this is the time, and maybe when you have a glass of champagne in your hand, this is the time where new and creative ideas might flow. Um, and then when you, when you acknowledge those, how impossible or weird it might feel or sound to you or other people work on those start them now it's the perfect time okay pisces what is rising up in you the main message this new moon is bringing you and the final outcome and then also i draw you uh, an angel card for either extra info or guidance Come on, building. There we go. This this deck has been so funky today. I've, I say it almost in every reading. It's it's never done this before. It's it's just it's funky energy, and it's it. I feel, I feel that playfulness in in this deck. It's like it wants to go everywhere. It's like a a child that's on a sugar rush or something. You know, it's that excitement and that play and that go here and go there. It's, it's beautiful energy, really. Right, so guys, what's rising up in you? This card has been coming up a lot during these readings. And the answers you need are coming, full moon in Gemini. So obviously you are searching for answers. Maybe you have had the creative idea, but you just don't know how to get it to work. And that might be the answers that's going to come in with this new moon for you. Um, the main message this new moon is bringing you, the End of a tough cycle approaches, full moon in Capricorn. Wow, so you are just ending off cycles here, Pisces. That's brilliant. Um, Capricorn is a very, very hardworking sign. So I feel that maybe you've been working so hard on something, but it hasn't really worked because there's always something that you need that you don't know. And that might be the answer that's coming for you. Your final outcome, work through your fears. New moon in Scorpio. So... With this, Pisces, it doesn't matter how scared you are to actually make a start on this impossible dream of yours. Now is the time to work through the fears and to actually get that going. Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Um, your angel card says, oh my gosh, I love this. Live your joy. Thank you, angels, for supporting me as I follow my joy. Like I say... With this play energy also. Look at that. Can you believe that? This, this is when you get to that place where you will see what you're really passionate about. And this dream that you have is all about something that you really, really enjoy. And when you are in this joyous, happy, playful energy, it's so much easier for that energy to be brought down into your reality and then you will be able to play this out. Oh my goodness, this is a beautiful reading, Pisces. I love that for you. Pisces, I wish you a wonderful new moon and I'll see you on the flip side.